Everything all right? Hare Krishna. Aradhita Jadi Hari Stapasadata Kim. Govinda Adipurus, he is known as Hari. Hari means who takes aside all your miseries. That is Hari. Uh, Hara, Hara means taking eye. Uh, harati. So, that's like thief also takes eye. Uh, but he takes eye, uh, the valuable things, material consideration. Sometimes Krishna also takes eye uh, your material valuables just to show you special favor. Just saham anugrinani harishita dhanam sanai. Jyadishthi Maharaj inquired from Krishna that we are supposed to be very pious. My brothers are great warriors. My wife is uh, exactly the goddess of fortune. And above all, you are our personal friend. So how is this that we have lost everything? <laughs> we have lost our kingdom, we have lost our wife, we have lost our honor, everything. So in reply to this, Krishna said, Jasaham Anugrin Nami Harishita Dharamjani. My first favor is that I take away all the riches of my devotee. And therefore, people are not very much enthusiastic to come to Krishna consciousness. Uh, but he does it just like the Pandavas were in the beginning put into difficulty. But later on, they become the most exalted personalities throughout the whole history. That is Krishna's favor. In the beginning, he may do like that because we have got attachment for our material acquisitions. So that is my personal experience. In the beginning, when my Guru Maharaj ordered me, I thought it that I shall first of all become a very rich man, then I shall preach. <laughs> so I was doing very nice in business. In the business circle, I got very good name. And with whom I was dealing business, they were very satisfied. But Krishna made so strict that he broke everything. And he obliged me to take sannyas. So that is Hari. Uh, so that I had to come to your country with only seven dollars. So they are criticizing. The Sami came here with no money. Now he is so opulent. <laughs> so say so they are taking the back side. Black side, you see. Uh, but this thing is, of course, I have become profit, profitable, or I have acquired profit. I left my home, my children, and everything. I came here as a pauper with seven dollars, and uh, that is no money. But I have got now big properties, hundreds of children. <laughs> <laughs> and I haven't got to think for their provision. They are thinking of me. So that is Krishna's favor. In the beginning, it appears to be 
a very bitter. When I took sannyas, when I was living alone, I was feeling very bitter. I sometimes I was thinking whether I would done wrong by accepting. So now when I was publishing this back to Godhead from Delhi, one day one bull thrust me and I fell down on the footpath and I got severe injury. I was alone. So I was thinking, yeah, what is this? Uh, so I had many uh, days of very tribulations, but it was all meant for good. So don't be afraid of tribulations, I see. Go forward. Uh, Krishna will give you protection. That is Krishna's promise in the Bhagavad Gita. Kaunte apradijani hi nami bhakta pranasati. Kaunte my dear son of Kunti, Arjun. You can declare throughout the whole world that my devotees will never be vanquished. You can declare. And why he is asking Arjun to declare? Why he does not declare himself? There is many. Because if he promises, there are instances that he sometimes broke his promise. But if a devotee promises, it will be never broken. Krishna will give protection. Therefore he says his devotee that you declare. There is no chance of being broken. Krishna is so kind that sometimes he breaks his promise, but if his devotee promises, he takes a very careful attention that his devotee's promise may not be broken. That is Krishna. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Hare.